Well, good morning, guys. Good morning. And I am so glad that you are here with me on today. Well, I just wanted to reach out today on this Sunday in this chosen conversation to let you know something. Dear chosen ones, to let you know that you have been going without for way too long. You have been stuck in the narrative of lack way too long. You have been stuck in the mentality of this is the best it's going to be way too long. You have been stuck in robbing Peter to pay Paul way too long. And you have been stuck in this is just crazy and this is just my life for way too long. But I just wanted to reach out to let you know that the Lord says that it's time to let the shame go. God is saying in this hour that there's no shame. God is saying in this hour that there's no humiliation. God is saying for you today that the discomfort is walking away from you. I wanted to let you know that he's saying that the despair and the pain that you're feeling has been washed in the blood of Jesus Christ. I want you to know that he is saying all of all the bad things that's in your life that you constantly hold on to, God said, it's time for you to understand that that's over with. He's saying it's over with, that you have been going without way too long. I want to give you a scripture today, and that will be coming from Isaiah 61 and 7. For your shame, you shall have double, and for your confusion, chosen ones shall rejoice in their portion. Therefore, in the land that you're residing in today, you shall possess a double everlasting joy shall be unto you. In the land that you're, possess that you're in today, the Lord is saying, wherever you're dwelling in this earth, you're going to get double. But you have to understand that you have to let the fact that whatever left you go. You have to let the fact that whatever you lost go. You've been going without for way too long. And basically what God is saying right there is going without has been echoing through your mind, through your heart, and through the seat of your soul for way too long. But I heard God say double portions. Double portions in everything that you lost. Because of the confusion, because of the humiliation, because of the dysfunction, because of the mortification, because of the embarrassment, because of the guilt and shame that you've been feeling, because of the discomposure, because of the compunction, because of the lashings that you have received in your past, stop holding on to it because God has said, you've gone without for way too long. You've cried way too long. You've worried way too long. You've been in pain in your heart and in your mind for way too long. You've had question marks just dangling up in the atmosphere for way too long. I heard God say it's double portion. You're going to get a double portion on everything that you lost. God is saying, let go of what you lost and look forward to everything that you're gaining in this hour. Let go of the relationship that you lost. Look forward to the great relationship that you are gaining. Let go of the job that you lost. Look forward for the phenomenal job that you are gaining. Let go of the environment that you had to walk out of and had to take a step back. God said, I let you take a step back so you can spring so much forward in your future. Look forward to what you're gaining because God, people lie. People are dishonest. People say things that are not true all the time. But one thing I can say is that I have tested scripture I have touched the hem of the garment of Jesus in my mind. And one thing I can tell you for sure is that God is not a man and he ain't going to lie. So if he's saying, forget about what you lost, if he understands that you had to feel the discomfort, if he knows that it embarrassed you and you stuck with him, one thing I can tell you is double portions up in your life, double portions portions 
in your mental capacity, double portions in your hard space, double portions in your finances, double portions in the love of your life, walking into your experience, double portions on everything that you could possibly wrap your mind around. Get out of the past and the fog of what you lost and get lost in what you're gaining in God. Because all I am saying right now, in this hour, in this season, in this land, the roles have changed, baby. What's first is last and what's last is first. And I heard God said that you may have thought that you stole from the chosen ones. You may have thought that you displaced my chosen ones, but baby, it's spiritual. I heard the Lord say that it's double portions. I heard the Lord say that you're going to bask and have rejoicing joy in your inheritance. Not when you die, God said in this season, because spiritually you had to die so he could re re resurrect your mind to understand that the time is now for you to reap the recompense, the double portion of what you lost is double portions. Let go of the narrative and the lies that have been sown into your mind your whole life. But I heard God said that this is the hour that I am raising up a spiritual army of chosen ones to take the earth back. I'm raising you up out of the slumber in your subconscious and I'm stimulating neurons in your brain to shoot out electron, electrons throughout your body so that you can grab electronic waves in the air, radioactive waves of frequency to let you know who you are because it's double portion central going forward. I'm saying double portion central going forward. The Lord is saying that it is time for you to receive more than you lost. And to the next video, guys. Mm -hmm. Peace. Because I believe in you. Bye now.